What is up guys? It is me NJG and today we are playing Avanti Savoya. Everyone was affected by the war. Every corner of the world was touched. The human spirit drove us to fight where no one had dared to go before. Whether it was All right, let's do this. Let's see what this has in store for us. Avanti Northern Italy, fall 1918. Italy and Astro. You guys can read that. Elite Mountaineer. Okay. We either win or we all die. Wow. I'm not surprised though, that's how a lot of militaries are. Very brutal. Yeah. Sorry, us. Are you all right? We're ready for you to cut the cake. Wow, these are incredible. Yes, it was uh, an incredible time. <laughs> you looked very handsome in that uniform. That's not me, that's Matteo. Oh, of course. I'm sorry, Dad. Take as long as you need. No, no, it's okay, Tesoro. It's time I told you what happened to him. It was during our last battle together. Just a few days after our 21st birthday. My brother's battalion had been ordered to capture a fort deep into enemy territory. I wasn't going with him. I was part of a special unit with a different mission. Our task was to support Matteo's battalion. We were a proud unit. We changed the war for Italy. The Arditi. This looks like this is gonna be a very brutal, very brutal. While Matteo was pushing forward. I had to fight up the mountain and take out anything targeting his unit. Just hearing this story makes me worry for you. Don't worry. I was in a full suit of armor. Besides, the Aditi were proud volunteers. They would have done anything for Italy. A church was sitting at the base of the path. Enemy troops had fortified it. I had to fight them first. Get back! You dare fight me? Oh shit. I'm taking this position all by myself.
He dead. Dude, this is awesome. All that was left after the flame troops were some foot soldiers. After that, the church would be ours. Hello? <clears throat> Who's left? Good job, man. I'm still on the left. Get out of here. No! Damn it! We lost another. There's another. Fuck, they're all around us. We have the church. There was an artillery gun that was shelling us and the tails on it. I had to destroy it. And he was still heading to the fort? Right. I had to make sure he got there. <laughs> Back off then, mate. It sounds so realistic when he's breathing heavy into his into his um, helmet. Listen. Matteo and the entire Italian offensive was in danger as long as that artillery gun remained. So I had to take it down. Why did he disappear? Like he just disappears.
How'd you survive that? safe was to blow up the gun itself. That explosion was one of the sweetest sights of the war for me. But there was no rest. I could see an anti-aircraft gun over the next ridge that was taking out our planes. And that was my next target. Let's do it, boys. Let's get to that. I forgot what it was we're going after. Well, he obviously survives this because he's the telling the story. By Austro-Hungarian troops, I had to remove them before I could use the gun myself. I'm going to get destroyed there, mate, yeah? <laughs> I take down the last man, but then I hear a noise that I will never forget. Targeting Mateo's unit below me. So I do the only thing I can. It was me against an entire enemy bomber squadron. We had no reinforcements. If those men were killed, our advance would be completely altered, and I would have lost my tail. After the first few went down, they started targeting me. I had to stand my ground. Oh my god. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm fucked. I 
couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't do it except my fucking gun. It was me against an entire enemy bomber squadron. Those men were killed, our advance would be completely halted, and I would have lost my tail. After the first few went down, they started targeting me. I had to stand my ground. Fuck, 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 fuck. How the hell am I supposed to do this? I can Can I, I, I can I get off of it? And like run around for a second so I can like Can I? No, I can't. I'm not really getting irritated because I like this game, so Okay. We had no reinforcements. If those men were killed, our advance would be completely halted, and I would have lost my tail. First few went down, they started targeting me. I had to stand my ground. Fuck off here! Yeah. Look at this guy! Were you still safe behind your armor? Of course, of course. Nothing could dent it. Oh shit! They made an earthquake or like a landslide. Holy crap! He killed a lot of people. Holy crap. Did they really have this back in World War One? They wore these armored suits? Gone to hell. 
They blew up the mountain. They buried us. They buried themselves. Oh, God. Mateo. I had to find him. So I went down into that hell. It was my only choice. I had to find Matteo. He could have been anywhere. Dude, this freaking gun I'm holding is. This gun is freaking weird. Started with the first thing that came through the phone. There were allies pinned inside lodges. I needed to save them. is awesome. of enemy weapons in the lodges that we scavenged and prepared ourselves with. Holy frick. Come here. Come at me. Your truck is no match for my anti tank ball. Run, 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 run. Hello. Don't worry. We will get out of this alive. Oh shit, sorry about that. Oh my god. Yes. Through sheer force of will, we took out their firepower. The lodges were safe, and I had to move on. You never said, was Matteo in those lodges? No. The men said his unit had made it further up. Which way do they go? Oh, 
I'll go this way first. We will go this way first. Every part of me wanted to get out of the trenches. But I could hear Italian yelling. I knew my friends were trapped. Everywhere I looked, too late. I felt alone among ghosts. After a while, I couldn't even look at the bodies. We had to have made it to the fort. Some of the things I saw to Zora. I had to convince myself I wasn't dead. Like what? Fire. I'm gonna shot the fuck up. Oh shit, that's like an actual... Shit. There were two ways into the fort. I could either go through the underground tunnels or above ground by circling around the back. Not through the front? I no longer had my armor. It was impossible. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? None of them died just then? I don't know what. See if we find them. I still think about that field every day. How the hell did we get out here? Had almost stopped looking. Started giving in to the hope that Matteo had escaped. And then... No! No! You... You...
he never got older. And here I am, still. Yeah, but who dude. decides such things? Yeah, dude, but you. Oh my god, I can't speak. Upheaval followed the war. Empires collapsed. New countries were formed. The wo the world and our view of it was changed forever. Yeah, it was. Damn. Families were changed not only by those they lost, but also those who returned. Both the fallen and the veterans became known as the lost generation. The lost generation? The lost generation? Why are they called the lost generation? What? No, they're not. They're actually, they look the freaking. I don't know. Whatever. No, there was only two for this one. All right. All right. That is Avanti Savoya. That one was pretty freaking cool. I like that one. That's that was probably my favorite one. In the comments, tell me what one is your favorite Avante Savoia, Friends in High Places, Through Mud and Blood, or Storm of Steel. Be sure to comment down below, like the video, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one where we will play The Runner.